Akwa Ba to Ghana, the West African nation that seized Obama Zaz in 2009, so much so that the black master of the White House is leading me to believe that the land of slave camps is the best place to state that too many of our race keep acting like slaves instead of the beloved black stars that they truly are. I'm talking about how back in the days of slavery, monsters had to forbid us from going to school. But nowadays, we run away from the classrooms as if we're scared that the books have whips. Back in the days, monsters had to rip us apart from our families. But nowadays, we vacate the premises as if we still think somebody else has the power to own our own seeds. Back in the day, monsters had to force feed us the n-word. But nowadays, it's like we love to tongue kiss our molesters leftovers. It's revolting that we are not revolting. If we really want to run away from a state of submission, then perhaps we should stop fulfilling the fantasies of those who once owned us. Who knows? Our own dreams just might come true. Victor Kwanzaa, everyone. Victor Kwanzaa, live from Pecora Slave Camp. <laughs>